Hey, this is Adam Cochran with TalkingDigital.org and uh, Castellini on Computers, HelpMeRick.com with just a very quick video on how to uh, reset your Aries cable modem. Chances are if you have Bresnan telephone and internet or Comcast telephone and internet, uh, you have a modem that looks something like this. You'll notice that even though I have it completely unplugged, some little lights stay on on the front. Some models have a reset button in the back, but you'll find that a reset works a lot better if you pull the battery out, and that's usually what the Bresnan and Comcast uh, people recommend that you do. Pretty much any cable uh, internet service will use this type of modem. Now, the key to resetting this is to reach down here on the bottom, and there's two or three different models, but you're gonna find some battery doors or little latches on the bottom. In this case, the latch opens the battery door this way, other models it opens down like this. Once you've got the battery door out of the way, in this model we grab the little piece of ribbon and just pull the battery loose. That's all you have to do. On the other models you actually have to reach up inside and hold a prong down. It's very easy but you have to hold a prong down at the same time you pull. It works best if you use two hands. Once you've reset that, just plug the battery back in. doesn't have to be unplugged for very long. Then you just put the battery door back on and then plug everything in as, there you go, plug everything in as normal, and you should be good to go, but that's a necessary step, especially after the recent uh, Bresnan outages. I've found that that helps on most computers. I do have to reset the modem in that way. I also forgot to mention that if you have a router, if you have a router, you also will need to unplug the power from the back of the router, and that's usually a black plug, and you just pull that out, and then plug it back in, but do that after you've reset the modem.